Hello and welcome to this lesson. Now we're going to try to extract as much learning as we can from this uh, particular spreadsheet that we've calculated. So we've calculated the profit here. The monthly profit is really where the nice results are here for each month of the year. What if we want to calculate the year to date, year to date profit? And what I mean by year to date is in January, uh, that was the first month of the year. So year to date, we earned $28.02. In February, the year-to-date profit will be what we earned in February plus all previous months. So in this case, it would be plus January. For March, it'll be the March results plus everything that came before it and so on. How do we represent that in terms of a formula in Excel? Well, for January, uh, there were no previous months. So the year-to-date profit is just going to be the January results. So I'm going to make it a formula and I'm going to tell it, hey, pull in the value from January. We're not adding anything to it or anything. We're just going to treat it as a formula uh, like that. All right. Now, the reason I want to, to, to do it that way rather than just typing in $28.02 is because now if I make a change, like let's say the quantity has changed here, then everything updates. If I just type in hard numbers, then I, I don't benefit from that part of Excel that can ripple through and correct everything. Now for February we said that the year-to-date profit is going to be the February results plus everything that came before.